hello you're welcome how to solve for a and b in this nice system of equation let this be equation one and this be equation two then from equation one which is root a plus root b equals to five yeah let's square both sides we have we square on this side then we square this side that is from here this expansion becomes root a square then plus root b square then plus two times root a times root b which we can bring together as root a b equals to five square that's five times five and that's twenty five then simplifying further, square cancel square root a. We have a plus same thing here. Square cancel square root plus b. Then plus two times root a b and root a b from equation two. That same thing as five. <coughs> then times five here equals to twenty five. That is here we have a plus b. Then plus ten equals to 25 then taking 10 to this side become minus so we have a plus b equals to 25 minus 10 which we can write directly as 15 from there then next step from equation 2 we have root a b equals to 5 let's also square both side here then we square this side and also we square this side here square cancel square roots then we have a b equals to 5 square is 25 then we let's divide both side by here from here that this a cancel each other here then we have b here equals to 25 over here then substitute the value of b here into this equation here then the equation become a plus b now which is 25 plus a is now equals to 15 from there then let's multiply through here by here that this here this equation becomes a square plus 25 equals to 15a then from here taking 15a to this side and rearrange then we have a square minus 15a plus 25 then equals to 0 from here then we have a quadratic equation here we can solve this directly from the formula and here this becomes a equals to minus minus 15 plus or minus square root of minus 15 square minus 4 times 1 times 25 then over 2 times 1 and when we simplify this further we have a equals to here yeah, this become plus so that's 15 plus or minus square root of here we have 225 then minus 100 here over 2 from here that is here we have a equals to 15 plus or minus square root of 125 over 2 that is also here we can separate 125 as 25 times 5 and we have a equals to 15 plus or minus square root of 25 times 5 over 2 and root 25 here is same as 5 and we have a equals to 15 plus or minus 5 root 5 then over 2 that is from here we have two values of a which are the first one a equals to 15 plus 5 root 5 
over 2. And the second one we have 15 minus 5 root 5 over 2. And from here, using the relation we have, which is A plus B equals to 15 here, when we make with the subject here, B now equals to 15 minus A. Then <clears throat> we can use this to find the corresponding value of B. So if this is A1 and here this is A2 from here, then we can get we can equally get b1 and b2 that is here b1 equals to 15 minus a1 which is open bracket 15 plus 5 root 5 over 2 from here that is here minus you open this bracket and this gives us b1 equals to 15 minus 15 over 2. Let's separate this fraction. Then minus 5 root 5 over 2 from here. And here, when we bring this together, and we can bring this together here this is 15 over 1 this is SM2 here is 30 then minus 15 then minus 5 root 5 over 2 that is simply this is also 15 over 2 so b1 now equals to 15 over 2 minus 5 root 5 over 2 which is also b1 equals to 15 minus 5 root 5 all over 2 now the first set of solutions here we have a1 comma b1 is simply now 15 plus that's a1 15 plus 5 root 5 over 2 then b1 that's 15 minus 5 root 5 over 2 then also we can get the corresponding value of b2 from here then using this same relation here then b2 will now be equals to 15 minus a2 which is 15 minus 5 root 5 over 2 then minus also open here we have b2 now equals to 15 minus 15 plus 5 root 5 then over 2 also bringing this together as one lcm is one then two here so we have 30 minus 15 then plus 5 root 5 from here so here b2 is now equals to 15 plus 5 root 5 over 2. Now, the second set of solution now follows thus. Here we have a2, comma b2. The value of a2, which is 15 minus 5 root 5 over 2. Then, comma b2, we got 15 plus 5 root 5 over 2. So here we have the solution to this problem. And when we look at this, the value of A as the value of B here, and the value of B as the value of A here. And thank you for watching. Don't forget the steps. Subscribe for more videos. Turn the notification bell on. See you in next class and bye for now.